Humans have survived for thousands of years. They have faced challenges like drought, rain, floods, and recently, COVID-19. Bakeries in Kenya have also faced a similar challenges from early 2018 with packaging materials. And now, as we speak, high cost of energy, high cost of raw materials like flour, sugar, and name it. But finally, Bakewave has found a solution when it comes to cost of energy. Watch the entire of this video to understand how it's possible for you to produce each loaf with less than one shilling. The sound of the fan you hear behind me is not for a Boeing 737, but it is for a convection oven. And this fan, actually, this fan is the secret why we are producing each every loaf with less than one shilling. And every three packets of buns of six pack, we can spend only one shilling on power. This is how this is possible. So assuming this is a normal Kenyan loaf size, about 23 centimeters. Okay. So when I put it here, it fits perfectly, four of them. How this is possible is because Beckwave has gone back to the drawing board due to the high cost of living and has customized convection oven sizes not available anywhere else. Because when I measure inside of this convection oven, it is deep is 65 centimeters, as you can see, and width is 45 centimeters. As you can see, 45. 48, 49. So this is way, way bigger than not ordinary convection ovens. And it allows you to produce a large number of products within a short time. They are for giving you that insane saving that you have just spoken about. So for the loaves, this is one piece. I'll put uh, one, another one, two, and three. So they'll fit, uh, three of these will fit in one row and therefore, if I multiply by one, two, three, four rows, I'll get 48 loaves in a record 25 minutes. So it means in one hour, I can do 96 loaves. But do you know how much power it spends in one hour? Only two units of power. When I do with the normal Kenyan calculation times 30 shillings per unit, it means I'll spend 60 shillings to produce 96 loaves. And that's why when you divide 60 shillings with 96 loaf, you'll find that the cost of producing one loaf is actually less than a shilling, it's about 80 cents. So let's go to the buns. Assuming I don't bake bread, I bake buns or scones. This tray is bigger tray size because of the oven. It's not the ordinary tray size for, for, for convection ovens. So it is again uh, 40, 45 by 65. So they will fit 30 pieces of buns per tray and that means that for the six because when I'm doing uh, my technician illustrate when I'm doing buns I can space we have created a creative way of adjusting the trays he can show when I'm doing buns I will increase more trays and therefore I will end up with about six trays and therefore, it means 30 times 6, uh, it's 180 pieces of buns every 9 minutes. Because buns are smaller and they are not covered in a tin, that means they take about 9 minutes to bake. So if I can produce 180 pieces of buns every 9 minutes, let's say I just do 4-5 batches and spend the other time changing in between. So we are talking about 30 per tray and six trays, 180 in nine minutes. So I do five batches, I get 900 pieces of buns. So I divide by six because each packet contains six. So I'll get 150 packets of buns. But I will spend only, as you can see, for, for buns, it's one, two, three, four, five, six. So we can adjust the trays to maximize capacity. So if I do 150 packets, in one hour and I spend only 60 shillings. So it means 
the power I spend per packet is 60 divided by 150, which means I spend only 0.4 cent. And that's why we are saying, if I use one shilling, 1.2 shillings, I'll be able to produce three packets of buns. And that is the magic that Bakewave has come up with to be able to capture this high cost of living and inflation. Let me ask you, if you can generate such efficiency, how will you fail even on a crisis time like this? So let's go to the six saves of a convection oven. The first thing, the fan makes the oven uh, spread. The work of the fan is to spread the heat very fast around the oven and therefore reduces baking times. For loaves, it takes about 25 minutes and for buns, it takes about nine minutes. That saving of time saves money because when you bake for lesser time, you are likely to spend less because you spend less power. And therefore, the second most important saving for conventional oven is to save your money. And on that note, it is only spending this oven two units per hour. So that is itself will save you a lot of money. So we go to the third point. It saves you energy. Because if I have an oven that only consumes two units in one hour, which is a very minimal energy consumption, but yet produces so much product, that system saves you a lot of energy. The other most important is that this conversion oven saves you labor. Why? As you can see, to control this entire oven, I'll only need this one control panel. And I have enough light, which I can be able to see what is going on inside the oven. So I will not need to keep on changing temperatures here, up and down, up and down, but I will only use it. When the alarm rings, I will remove my product. So it's easy to operate and fast. And that is why point number four, the fourth saving is saves of labor. We don't need to employ a lot of people. This saving number five saves on maintenance costs. Let me explain this point. Bakewave has installed over 150 conversion ovens in the Kenyan market over a period of seven years. And we have realized that the only maintenance you need for a conversion oven is to clean it twice a month or once in a month using appropriate oven cleaner material. And that one, we, we train you as a bakery owner. It's part of the free training we give. We don't need to come to your site to do the cleaning. You, are, you can be able to do it by yourself. And that is the main issue, the only issue of maintenance that is required because conversion ovens are not mechanical and they have a very simple structure. And that is why this is possible. And let us not forget the saving number six, which is the most important. Conversion oven saves you marketing costs. Yes, it saves you marketing costs, but how is this? This is very advanced feature of it. It has steam. As you can see, this is a steam control system for steaming. And once you put in your product, you will come here, set the time that you want to steam. Basically, we steam after five seconds. So I'll come here, set the to five seconds. After putting in my product, then I put the timer on. So after five seconds, it will pour in water because at the back of this oven, we will it's connected to our water source. And when that happens, it impacts the texture of my product, especially bread, buns, scones, rolls, and everything, to golden brown color. And that golden brown color makes your product move very fast in the market. And that's why you don't need to market too much of your product. People will use their visual abilities just by use of the eyes they able to love your product fall in love and it is easy to sell itself so that's why in a way it contributes to saving of your marketing costs so those are the six saves of a convection oven this six tray oven will give you up to 960 loaves in 10 hours but assuming i have bigger production i want to do i'll go to this 10 tray convection oven. These 10 tray convection ovens will give you 1,680 loaves in 10 hours. And let's say I want to do 
even more loaves. Let's see how this impacts. Does it save more? Does it save less? And if I'm targeting 2,000 loaves, I'll go for this because in one hour it produces 192 pieces. That is 96 at a batch. So in 10 hours, I'll be able to produce 1,920. But for buns, cones, and everything, we are talking about 30 pieces here. And, but these trays are 12 pieces. So when I do the maths, how many packets of buns I can produce in a day? So it will 30 pieces times 12. It's 360 per batch of nine minutes. Assuming I do five batches in an hour, Look about 1,800 pieces of buns. So I want to see how many packets. So divide by six. In one hour, I produce 300 packets. So in 10 hours, I look about 3,000 packets of buns. So if I have a higher volume of loaves and buns, I'll go for the bigger capacity. So now let's see the saving. So this is the standard Kenyan loaf, 400 grams, 20 centimeters. So if I put here, as you can see, they will, again, as we saw in the smaller oven, they will go in two more rolls here. So one, it'll be another band here and another band here. So they will, it means per row, it takes 12 pieces. So 12 times eight, because for, for bread, we space, we remove the middle ones, for example, this, for us to fit the tray for loaves. So because we need a bigger gap. So we will remove this. And then we will move this up here. So we'll end up creating eight spaces. So I will do my calculation. If I do 12 by eight, 12 by eight comes to 96 loaves in 25 minutes because of the fan system. Remember the bigger oven actually has two fans. So this is, means the heat spreading and efficiency is even much better. So if I'm doing 96 loaves per batch, if I do two batches in an hour, it's 192 loaves. Remember, this oven is bigger, so it consumes five units of energy. So five units with the Kenyan rate times 30 shillings comes to 150 shillings. With 150 shillings, I produce 192 loaves. So I spend 0.78 which is about 0.8 cent, less than a shilling, to produce one loaf. So let's go to buns. Assuming I'm now in the buns, so again, it will take 30 pieces per tray. But remember, for this, we will use less spacing. So we will come here, we will reduce this spacing, and so on and so forth. So we'll end up creating 12 rows. So let's see, 30 pieces per tray. Let's go 30. If we go 12, so it's 360 per nine minutes. Assuming we do only five batches and we use the other 10 minutes in an hour to change in between. So 360 do by a batch of five, 1800 pieces of buns. Remember these are pieces, so to convert them to packets, to see the number of packets, I'm going to have 300 packets. Remember the oven consumes only five units, which is equivalent to uh, 150 shillings. So let's see. So I do 150 divided by 300 packets. So cost per packet is 50 cents, 50 cents. So I will spend 50 cents from this oven to produce one packet of buns of six pack. The same will apply to queen cakes and so on and so forth, other products. So this means that I will be saving so much but producing a larger volume. Remember in 10 hours, I'll do 3,000 packets of buns of six pack. And uh, that means that I'll be able to supply the volumes that I want to achieve. So now that you have seen what, how, this magic is possible. How it's possible to produce one packet of buns using only 50 cent and one loaf using only one shilling depending on, on the oven and sometimes 0.8 shillings. Now, what has Bakewave done? Bake, apart from customizing the oven, Bakewave has come with offers 
So we are talking about this oven for me to produce 960 loaves. What do I need? I need a spiro mixer, bread slicer, prover, tins, trays, cooling racks, sink, and all that. Bakewave has ca customized or has packaged each oven, complete package of each oven ready for you to buy. And when you buy that, you receive other bonuses. So this is 960 loaf full package. It has about eight machines, eight equipment in it, not apart from the oven. 10 tray, you'll have 10 tray oven, the matching spiral mixer, the matching proofer, slicer and everything packaged together into a package. That will give you 1,680 loaves. For the 12 tray, the same. It has to have its matching mixer, slicer, all these machines together. So all those three packages are available at a very huge offer because if you buy those packages within 30 days, you will receive the following. You will come to our offices, you receive free advice depending on your market where you are setting up this bakery. You sit down with the experts. They'll analyze your market, the income level, the target market, and they advise you the best products that you can venture into. Remember right now, the baking industry is changing because people are looking for affordable but healthy products. And Bakewave has able to advise you on such kind of products that can move very fast in such an environment because people are looking for something they can buy for 10 shillings and so on and so forth. So you'll sit down, the point number one, when you march to our offices today, you receive advice from experts on the market and the type of product that you're going to bake. The second thing that will happen, we will go to your site and we'll do a layout on the bakery equipment that will allow you to complete the wiring process, complete the uh, plumbing process, because as you said, the office requires steam, prover requires steam. So we'll draw for you the structure for electrical uh, installation and the materials that you require according to manufacturer specifications. And we'll also do a layout in accordance to international food safety standards. After that, we we'll take the equipment, we'll do the installation. Our master chef will come to the ground. They will bake with you the products that we advise you according to the market and they give you the right recipes to be able to achieve that and they will also advise you on other things like simple oven maintenance practices and so on and so on and also you receive a copy of international food safety standards hscp that has been developed by bakewell to allow you to follow the best manufacturing practices so all this is included in the price. This is insane offer, whereby we plug everything ready for you. You just plug in into our system and start making money today. Thank you so much. Hope to see you. Let's develop profitable, sustainable bakery business. Thank you.